Hey guys, it's Danny the Plumber. I've got my little nephew, Charlie. He's gonna help me um, unclog a clogged toilet. Uh, I'm not gonna use a plunger, I'm gonna use a closet auger. Here I'm at my brother's house uh, in Manhattan Beach and Charlie's mom says that Charlie clogged the toilet because he took a poop in it. I don't believe a little guy like that, come on, look at him, can actually clog a toilet. So I'm determined to find out what's inside this toilet. All right, right now, I'm just uh, verifying that it is in fact clogged and you can see the water is not going down and coming up. Um, if that water uh, comes any higher, I'm gonna be prepared to shut that flapper down immediately so no more water goes into the tank and pull up on the ball cock. But this style ball cock, you actually can't pull up on, so I'll be prepared to shut that angle stop off right there. But I'm not worried about it. It's not coming up uh, much more than that. Um, so, like I said, let's get started. I'm going to show you how to unclog the toilet like plumbers do. So this is a closet auger, also known as a toilet auger. This one is three feet here with an extension inside so I can lift it up and make it six feet long if I have to. That's convenient when the uh, cloggage is beyond the toilet trap. And the toilet trap is right here. Don't know if the camera can see it. Right in this area is the toilet trap, right there. And that just traps a little water in there so we don't get fumes from the sewer line. All right, so this closet auger works like this. Undo it here, slide it up like that. This is a protective uh, rubber material. You don't want to scratch the bottom by sticking that metal in and scratching it all up. So we'll put that metal in and kind of softly balance it on that rubber right there. Next step is shove it in there and use this handle and force it down as you turn. Just a little pressure is needed. And most of the time the cloggage is right in the trap so we don't even have to go very far and we'll see it, uh, it unclog as soon as that water comes down. So here we go. Yeah, I feel something right there. That water should be draining. If not, we will pull it out, see if there's anything on it. See a little debris there. And at this point, we can either do a little flush to see if it's still clogged, which I think it is. It is. Now I'm ready to turn that angle stop off if it comes up any further. But like I said, I don't think it is. All right, I like to do it when the water's in there. It's even easier. So we may have to go down for the extension. fun but I'm going to continue breaking that debris up whatever it is it was pretty hard in there and I'm going to pull it out and see if I got it look at that <laughs> some jackass put a sponge down there of some sort or real tough rag that's why what I was fighting and uh, you can see that this closet auger really grabbed onto it. This is why I like these things. You could uh, plunge to your blue in the face and knock off that. Really wound up in there, real tight. All right, let's go ahead and flush it one more time. 
I always have a bucket, five gallon bucket, because the end of that thing is real dirty. All right. Beautiful. So that's how you unclog a toilet with the closet auger, also known as a toilet auger. Yeah, I knew little Charlie didn't clog that toilet on his own. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, please like it, subscribe, leave a comment below. And if you want to see a great or disgusting video, watch my video on how to unclog a toilet with your bare hands. I'm going to put a link in the video right now. Thanks. Have a good day, guys.